Hey everyone, I've been looking for a clamp-on amp meter for use on the RV for diagnosing uh, various electrical issues and instead of just using a regular old a voltmeter that I've had for years. So I uh, picked up this Southwire uh, clamp meter from Lowe's. So it was just under $80 and of course after the state of Michigan took their cut that they definitely do not use for fixing the roads around here, uh, it was about $86. Um, Apparently uh, these are made by Maxis, um, so it's supposed to be a decent brand. Uh, the key to this one is that it is, uh, you can see there, it's 400 amp AC and DC. A lot of these meters uh, only do amperage like on AC, and then they'll just do voltage on DC. And it's kind of tricky the way the packaging is written out, so you want to get the 400 amp or, or more uh, AC and DC. Um, current tester. So uh, this one happens to have true RMS, which uh, may come in handy at some point. I don't know exactly what that does, but we'll be learning about it. Um, and uh, lots of good features. So I'm going to attempt to get this opened up here and uh, hopefully won't have to uh, make a trip to the emergency room. Well, no blood was shed this time uh, opening the childproof packaging. See, it's a nice uh, setup here. Comes with a nice uh, zippered, padded case. Uh, temperature probe says this will do up to uh, 1400 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, comes with its own uh, first set of AAA batteries. Your uh, test leads for using as a kind of like a regular multimeter. And then the uh, ammeter itself and a uh, nice set of instructions. The case is really uh, durable, has a nice grippy feel to it, um, easy to hold on to, and we're going to have to get a small Phillips screwdriver for putting the new batteries in. And they cleverly put the uh, anti-theft device in the battery compartment, just uh, laying in there loose so you just pull that out and uh, throw it away. And a nice feature that they thought of here was they put these little uh, red rubber washers on the uh, screws so when you undo the battery compartment the screws stay on the lid so you don't risk losing them. And last we uh, remove the little protective label there and we can uh, turn it on and see what the screen looks like. It's supposed to have a very high definition screen. They call it a 4000 count and looks pretty good. So. Uh, I'm going to uh, work on learning how to use this, uh, and in the spring when we get the RV out of storage, we'll start working on some projects and hopefully get some tutorials and things going. Look for a full write-up on ClassicRV.net on the Southwire 21050T True RMS AC-DC Clamp Meter, and we hope to see you on the forum. Thanks.